Welcome back. This is Ramaz and it's me, Priska Jasa. So next topic is division algorithm for polynomials. So here is an equation which we studied in earlier. Uh, that is dividend is equals divisor into coefficient plus reminder. Divi dividend is equal to divisor into coefficient plus reminder. Suppose we take 11 as dividend. Okay, 11 as dividend. Then uh, we have to divide this number with 2 that is divisor is 2 what we get 5 times 2 10 and here it is 1 so this 1 is a reminder and 5 is the quotient so how, we, how can we rewrite this uh, number that is 2 times 5 plus 1 right dividend 11 is equal to divisor 2 into quotient 5 plus reminder 1. Okay. So, 2 times 5, 10, 10 plus 1, 11. Uh, think this same statement, we can divide any polynomials. Okay. Let's see. So, for any polynomial, P of X is equal to G of X into Q of X plus R of X. That is, for any polynomial, we can write P of X is equal to G of X into Q of X plus R of X. Okay, getting an ex example, I will explain it for you. Now, we are moving to long division. That is, divide 2x square plus 3x plus 1 by x plus 2. This is an example. Uh, this is an example question which is in your NCRT textbook. Okay, so, uh, yeah, 2x square plus 3x plus 1 divided by x plus 2. And let uh, this be P of X and uh, this is G of X. Okay. Then listen carefully. That is here the first thing is X and here it is 2X square. So quadratic polynomial and it just starts with 2X square. Then first step is we have to uh, find out a term. That is X, X times a number gives 2x square. We have to find out this missing term first. Okay. So, what is it? x times 2x which is equal to 2x square. Right. Is it clear? So, this term is the first one. That is 2x. Okay. And multiply this 2x with x first. Okay. So, 2x into 2x gives 2x square. Okay. So first step is x times the missing number is equal to 2x square. We have to find out this missing term that is x times 2x gives 2x square. Okay. So uh, we take this number here. We write this number here that is 2x times x gives 2x square. Then we have to multiply this 2x with this constant term 2. Okay. So, what is the answer? 2x, uh, 2x times 2 is 4x. Okay. Then, by normal division, we have to subtract these terms. So, 2x square minus 2x square is 0. 3x minus 4x. That is 3x minus 4x is minus x. Right? So, this is minus x. And here it is 1. Okay. So, next, next one is we have to find out the uh, next quotient term. So, um, okay. Here it is minus x. And x times a, a, x times a number gives minus x. So, what will be here? Here it is minus 1, right? X times minus 1 gives minus x. Okay. So, here the next thing is minus 1. Okay. Then minus 1 times x gives minus x. As we did in the first question. Here minus 1 times x gives minus x. Then multiply these two terms together. That is 2 times minus 1 gives Minus 2. 
Is it clear? Then my normal method, normal division method, here it is plus and here it is plus. So what is the answer? 0, x minus x is 0 and 1 plus 2 gives 3. So this is the remainder and this is the quotient. So, um, hope it is clear for you. I will explain again. That is 2x squared plus 3x plus 1. Uh, first we have to uh, first we have to divide this 2x square with x and we get 2x okay then 2x times x gives 2x square then uh, multiply this 2x with 2 which is equal to 4x and by subtracting uh, we get minus x plus here it is 1 here this is 0 and minus x plus 1 again we uh, follow the same method <coughs> same step that is x divided by minus x or uh, x, x multiplied this minus 1 with, uh, with minus 1 and we get minus x then minus 1 times 2 gives minus 2 and by normal division we um, change the sign and it becomes 0 and this is 3. So this is the long division in uh, polynomials. Okay. So we have to rewrite as Here, this is P of X and this is G of X and what is uh, Q of X? Q of X is equal to 2X minus 1 and what is R of X? Reminder, it is 3. And uh, there is a interesting fact that this 3 can be written as X to the power 0. No need, uh, I just mentioned here that is um, x to the power 0 is 1 so 1 times 3 is 3 you no need to write x to the power 0 I just uh, mentioned it here so that is the method of uh, algor uh, al division algorithm for polynomials so this is the method to uh, divide polynomials ok one more question for you that is divide 3x cube plus x square plus 2x plus 5 by 1 plus 2x plus x square. So this is p of x and this is g of x. And uh, listen, this g of x can be rewrite as x square plus 2x plus 1. Okay, both are same. So we have to take this one. And uh, now we are going to divide these two polynomials. That is 3x cube plus x square plus 2x plus 5 divided by x square plus 2x plus 1. Okay. In the pre uh, just like in the previous case, uh, here the first term x square and here it is 3x cube. We have to find out a term x square multiplied with a number and we get 3x cube. So we have to find out this missing number. So it is uh, 3x. Okay. So what is it? 3x into x square is 3x cube. Okay. Multiply this 3x with each and every term of the g of x. Then this is 3x cube plus 3x times 2x is 6x square. Then 3x uh, times 1 is 3x. Then by normal method, what is it? This is 0 and here it is minus 5x square then minus x plus 5. Okay. I take this minus 5x square and x. Then <coughs> x square multiplied with a term and we get minus 5x square. So what will be the term? It will be minus 5. Okay. So minus 5 and multiply by this uh, multiply this minus 5 with each and every term so minus 5 times x square is minus 5 x square then minus 5 times plus 2x gives minus 10x then minus 5 times 1 is minus 5 okay so by sign changing uh, we get here this thing is 0 and minus 1 
sorry minus 1 plus 10 gives 9x and here it is 5 plus 5 is 10. Okay, so this is the remainder and this is the quotient. Okay, is it clear for you? Actually, this is uh, a difficult problem in this chapter. So you have to practice this. Uh, you have to practice it well uh, and study each and every steps involved in the problem. Okay, so this is the answer.